Hey guys, Phoenix here, and welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach Revisited. We're in the atrium, uh, we just went down to uh, visit Chica in the loading docks, do that little section where you were the staff bot, um, and we are going to go into Phaser Blast, because if you know in this series, if you've been watching, um, you know that we're doing everything opposite to my original series. Um, last time I went to Monte Golf, so we're going to go Phaser Blast. Um, what was I going to say? Yeah, look at the lights by the way. I noticed this whilst editing that one of the uh, last videos. Um, they actually change. Um, I, d I never noticed that. They, I thought they were just one light, but they actually change from like red to purple to blue. Um, just a nice feature that I, I never really noticed. And also the roof. You never notice that there's just a star pattern there. They could have easily got away with making that just black. I mean, the atrium is just very cool, but yeah. So, Freddy. We are going to do your uh, attraction now. We're going to go to Phaser Blast. Get all the stuff. We're going to go to Bunny Bowl and stuff like that. But yeah, a very cool area. Just quickly, I just want to show you guys um, if Freddy will come here. Although you can't actually open... Oh, come on, Freddy. You're like inches away. Yeah, you can actually open these doors when Freddy's next to it. You can't go in, unfortunately, because they patched it. I'm so annoyed about it. But these, I'm pretty sure at the bottom of there, it's not like the area that was cut isn't, isn't loaded in, so you couldn't go in anyway, like behind that door. Um, but yeah, it's just cool to see like an area like this that you would never usually be able to get to. Also, look at this. Like, you never really get to see the signs up close. It's so high quality. You can even go underneath it and behind it. But yeah, we're going to go into Phaser Blast. Uh, we'll use the party pass. Um, this guy will do his little dance and it'll actually go away instead of just disappearing like in how he used to. Right, are you coming, Freddy? There we go. Ah, Phaser Blast, sport of kings. You will need to win the game in order to receive your very own Phaser Blaster. Good luck. Yeah. Calling all recruits. Phaser Blast is a high-intensity space combat simulation. Suit up and save the universe as you blast everyone and everything with high-tech laser effects. Blast strangers, blast your friends, beat the superstar score, and get a free Phaser Blaster gun. Enlist now. Whoa. Gregory, I'm not nearly that annoying, am I? <laughs> oh, I love that little line. Like, that whole piece of dialogue there from him introducing Phaser Blast to the intercom saying it to him responding to the intercom it like that was all cut in the original game and they added it back and I, I, it just adds so much personality to the game you know so we could go in there and get the bunny ball ticket and stuff like that but first we'll just save the game in fact no we won't save the game just yet I'll go and get the prize that is in Freddy's one I think uh, what's this no it's the ch is it the cheek of Freddy keychain yeah we need to get the uh, Freddy one actually from the, like the actual, I don't know, I guess that would be the lobby of the Phaser Blast down there, so I don't know what this is, but either way, yeah, we need to get that in a bit, and I know the Roxy one is in the office where we'll get the Bonnie Bowl ticket, or the bathroom of the office, but yeah, this is very like, re like a realistic, um, it, like, it looks like a laser tag area. And not only that, like this area here, like, you know, where they talk about the health and safety rules. Freddy Blue. Finally done. Yeah, I mean that like that is quite a realistic thing, you know. Like you would have like this little room here where you'd sit down and just listen to the instructions and stuff. Um, it's also weird how like humanoid this one moves. Like he was, well, he or she, I'm not even sure. He's, he's a freaking robot. I don't know. Yeah, it was moving so like fluently compared to the other staff bots. They all move quite robotically compared to that one. So, but yeah, weird how they use the FNAF one sound effect for the doors as well. I suppose it's just a callback to that, but you know, it's just weird. You can enter the arena. You need to grab the helmet and the yeah. High tech laser effects, they're not actual lasers, yet somehow they affect the other bots and like the glam rocks. Um yeah, let's go. This is such a cool mini game, I really like it, like the capture the flag and stuff. Yeah. Whoa, hello! Already? Also the hiding place. Do you know, I found out this recently actually, that you can hide 
I've never known this was a thing. Also, it doesn't really make sense in real life. Like, why would you hide in this? But anyway, also lol's hacks. I have, a, I have a, something to say about him. You ever noticed how any has been hotel fans out there? He looks, he kind of looks like Vox, you know, like with the TV screen and like the really like the little antennas in the top. Uh, but yeah, lol's hacks is from Freddy in Space too. Yeah, I think he was the main antagonist. Get you. I think yeah, it's only like 20 seconds that we have to defend this. Oh, hello. Whoa. Didn't know you were there. What? I didn't even- Oh no, I'm out of ammo. Please don't get it. I'm literally out of ammo. Please don't. Okay, just in time. I literally didn't have any ammo, I was gonna say. Can we get on here? Oh, we can. Right. Uh, the next one is... I think it's under here, actually. Right, I've got the flag. Come get it. I swear these staff bots ju Oh my god, they do. They just spawn down there. That's so weird. Are you... Um, hi. Well, you're a bit of a glitch, aren't you? Well, no one's going for it, so... You are clipping through the floor, that's so weird. Are you going to explode? Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, this is the final one. Five in a row. Oh no, oh no, Chica, please. Oh no. Don't tell me she's still coming, is she still coming? Oh no, this is bad. I just hit you! I just Chica freaking Chia. Yeah, the hitboxes are a little funky in this game, but you know, it's not meant to be a first person shooter, you know, it's just it makes a cameo, that's all, so. Right, you've already seen me do all this, so I'll probably just wait until uh I'll probably just cut even to when I've done it all. Take out all these guys. Is that guy still glitched over there? Dude, you're literally clipping through the floor. I've never seen that before. Got ya, and you explode. The alien army. Good job, space cadet. Proceed to the winner's elevator for your reward. Yeah, yeah, I love that mini game. Um. Oh, hi, Chica. I really don't want to be dealing with you right now. Oh my God. Yeah, you can't do that, can you, Chica? You know, one thing I did see is that this whole area has a completely different like. Um, preset of lighting for if you lose and I know I lost the Chica but I mean like lose all your health all of like these um, lights turn off and the reflections look so good but they weren't on Xbox they were like on PC and it was just a screenshot I saw so I want to try um, see if I can I'll do this again and I'll come back and I'll purposely die um, as in run out of health and then I will try and show the lighting if it if it looks really good so yeah cut to that now I hate to do this but uh yeah. Ah, uh, this is just... Game over. Yeah, whoa. Like, look! Right. Yeah, I don't know, I just wanted to, like, look at that. This whole area, like, it has a completely different set of lighting for when you lose. Like, it's like, um... It's just completely turned off. Um... Like, whoa, look at this! Oh my god! Like, look how beautiful that is. Like, I don't know, it's just... This is some of the best lighting in the game, and it is... It only occurs on such a specific occasion, you know? But, yeah. Like, it, it just looks so good. Yeah, right, let's actually go and, uh... Get the, uh, Bonnie Bowl uh, stuff from the office. Alright! The Fazer Blaster. The golden one. Quarter past four in the morning. Um, Chica's still down there. Uh, but, yeah... Fazer Blast, very cool. Um, I love the idea of like if you win, you have this own your own like little um, winners lounge with like a disco ball and stuff. But yeah, let's see where this vent goes. Where does this vent go? Well, we know where it goes up to Vanny's hideout, which is pretty cool area. Um, I do think it could have been better. This is the thing, like the room just looks kind of basic. I mean, it has a name written on the wall in purple, which is like a nice touch. Yeah, that's just something I really like. Freddy. That rabbit lady's in a secret room above Fazer Blast. It looks like a hideout. I think her name is... Fanny? Fanny. It is very similar to Vanessa. 
and also Bunny. That cannot be a coincidence. Yeah, so that basically confirms where the name came from, just Vanessa and Bunny. Uh, which I think we kind of already knew, but just, you know, confirms it. But yeah, like some other cool stuff, if it was a bit bigger as well, because it's so small. Um, and you know, just like maybe some stars dangling from the ceiling, like FNAF 1 style. Um, just some props around, just just stuff about Vanny, just to make it feel a bit more personalised. Um, but yeah, you get a good view of the arena from down here. Um, but yeah, and then obviously we will not go through here because if you go through here you can like completely break the game and get an ending that you're definitely not supposed to get at this point. Um, but yeah. Uh, so what are we doing now? We're going to go to Bonnie Bowl. Yeah, that's what we're going to do. Yeah, and like you get a really good view here as well. I've always said that it looks so much bigger. Like there's this one screenshot that they showed of the game. Um, it looks so much bigger here than it actually does when you're, you know, it, here in game. I'm not sure what it is. Maybe they did actually cut. Like, I don't know. Maybe they just rearranged it or something, but... Alright, so now the little lobby area will be filled with staff bots. Um, and we'll just go into the office. Job, and, uh... You got the oh no, there ad actually isn't. But you had to use your party pass. If you find the security office, I am sure you will find something that will help you. Yeah. So Space Rock's a keychain. I'm sure it's when we get um, the Bonnie Ball ticket that um, the staff bots will appear out there. Again, nothing really happens when he says that. Yeah, so we got all this cool stuff. I love how much stuff you get in this room. You just walk in and it's just gifts everywhere. Recharge your flashlight, get the bunny ball ticket, get the security badge, get this message. Again, as I was going to say, but Freddy was talking. Um, just, he says that get out because they, they know you're here. Nothing happens. Like, imagine, you see this monitor? Imagine when he said that Vanny appeared. And, like, if you stay in here too long, Vanny will come and get you. You know? Little ways like that to implement her into the game again. Now they'll be the staff bots, yeah. And we'll save the game, just because... Hopefully those staff bots don't get me from here. Okay, hi Freddy. We're gonna go to Bonnie Bowl where you'll see, uh, well, be reminded of an unfortunate past. But we'll get to that when we see it. I love that voice line. Oh, it's so cool. It really like makes the Pizzaplex seem like grand and you know, the best place to be. Alright, I do remember that we gotta go to up here just to get this little gift. And then we will go to Bonnie Ball. Uh, Space Freddy Keychain. But yeah, like a like a laser a, a Freddy Fazbear themed laser tag experience. So cool. Like I wish there was something like that in real life. Just laser tag but like FNAF themed. I mean I just imagine the Pizza Plex was real in general. That would be just absolutely insane. Hi Roxy. Who's there? Also, the Glamrock Beauty Salon over there is completely covered in that grey like material, because obviously it's under construction. But in this screenshot for the atrium, like the first time we saw the atrium, um, you can see it, and it's just unfortunate they had to be covered up. I know it obviously was something later down the line that they implemented, where it's uh, it's under construction, they had to cover it. But um, it would just make it seem so much better if you could actually go over there and, well, just see it in, in general. Wait, we can actually get in... Surely we can't get in whilst... No, we can't. I was going to say. Do a little dance. I remember you... Oh! My God! That was... Oh! Fam! Did you see that, Freddy? I am sorry, Gregory. <sighs> Unbelievable. Roxy, man. How did she get there that quickly? She was literally... Do you remember? I literally was on the, fl on the bottom floor. And I was like, I was like, hi Roxy. We went up to her, and all of a sudden she's at the top. Also, another thing: who keeps placing and removing the security barriers around here? Like, I know it would purely just be for the plot, but do you remember in the atrium chase, they're all just set up around here. They're all gone now. Like, you know, obviously again, it'll just be for the plot that they're there, so you can't access areas you're not supposed to go to. But it doesn't really make sense in universe. Okay, we can actually get in. Right, Freddy, come on. Whoa, my God. Whoopsie. <laughs> all right. Bonnie Bowl. Kind of like Rockstar Row with all of the, like, display cases, you know, the trophies, and the bowling balls and bowling pins and stuff. Um, yeah, let's go get the Monty Mystery Mix. Look at the reflections. 
hunting mystery mix behind the bowling alley. She can really? For mix. Again, I love that they added that in. But oh my god, look at the reflections. Look at the material. Look at the. Oh my god. Like, you know, when Steel will, like, sometimes they'll just focus on one area specifically where they will just excel at, you know, I don't even know if, I don't think ray tracing's even on. Because I'm on the Xbox Series X. I'm not sure if, I don't think I have that. But, you know, it really looks like it. Like, look how cool and, like, you know, if this isn't ray trace, God, what will it look like with? And, you know, this is without a flashlight. I think it looks better without, to be honest. You know, you got all the all of these arcades and stuff. But yeah, it's just so cool. Uh, right, what we're we doing? We will go over here and get this because if we do this any later, then we'll probably be attacked by the endos that literally crawl out from under here, which does makes absolutely no sense. Oh, for some reason the lobby ambience just started playing. Maybe it's because I got too close to here, which is. Oh yeah, that is why. If you go close to the walls, I'm not sure if you'll be able to hear it, but you can hear um, the lobby ambience, just because that also plays in uh, Roxy Raceway, which is through this wall and below there. You used to be able to see it in one of the pre-maps, um, well, in one of the early builds of the game. You could actually look down on it, but obviously that would be too much for the game to handle to have Roxy Raceway loaded in whilst you're over here. They also removed this staff bot that was just standing here awkwardly for no reason, which is good. How is this ice cream still not melted? We've been here for like... Four hours since the pizza plex closed, and it's still just sat there perfectly. I do not come up here anymore. I miss him. Yep, and that is very sad and uh, open voice line from Freddy. You know, it just gets you speculating. But um, so yeah, he was obviously friends with Glamrock Bonnie, and uh, he's gone. So that's why he doesn't come up here. It's just a nice voice line, you know. Again, it adds more personality to him. Um, but yeah. We're going to end this pretty shortly. We'll get this, and we'll get the Monterey Mystery Mix. Um, then we'll go down and get the... I think it's the Golden Monty plush. Monty's Mystery Mix. The mystery is the pizza flavoring. Yeah. Again, I, I'm pretty certain that wasn't in the game originally. Uh, but oh, just hearing like stuff that originally was in the files, and like you had to you know, watch like Tetra Bit Gaming's... Um, you know, unused stuff in security breach videos to be able to see stuff like that or go rooting through the files to find these hidden um, audio files and now a, a lot of them have been added back in and it's just it's just nice to see, you know? Yeah, Golden Monty and the Nightmare on Plush which oh, has caused so many debates. How the hell did that get up there? God, it must have shot right up to the ceiling and then landed there. That's God, if I caught that on camera that would have been good. Obviously you got the Circus Baby staff bots uh, they look kind of more like Eleanor, which, uh, yeah, I, I, spoiler alert, I do not like Eleanor, I do not find her character interesting even remotely, and her design is much even worse, but anyway, much even worse, that didn't make sense, I don't know, but anyway, it's probably time to wrap this up, and um, thank you so much for watching, as always, in the next episode, ooh, what do we do in the next episode? Oh, we decommission Chica, don't we? Yeah, we do, ooh, that's gonna be good. We go down to the trash compactor in the loading docks, lure her in, and uh, yeah, do a bit of a madness. But anyway, see you in the next video.